What's going on, everybody? It's your boy. Moving up. Uh, coming at you with a new video. Um, so just today, actually, they uh, riot League of Legends, the game I always play and post on my YouTube channel and uh, what I stream on my Twitch channel, which you guys should check out if you're watching this video and you haven't. Um, they just released Hex Tech Crafting. Hex Tech Crafting. I'm going to show you guys what that is. We're going to do a little bit of an opening. Um, I've got some leftover RP, and um, I guess we'll just hop into it. So I'll switch scenes here. Make my face small so you don't have to see me. Actually, I'll just turn it off so you don't have to see me. Um, and it's just all my background and whatnot and the actual lead client. So you go into your loot and crafting inventory. You can see I've already got a, a skin shard. And the skin shard allows me to, if I upgrade it, it gives me the permanent skin. And you use your orange essence, which can be opened here, either in crates or if you open up a certain amount of crates, they give you some. Like I'm going to do a five crate opening, and they'll give me like 50 essence for it or whatever. That, along with keys to open it, that, that gives you a bunch of different shards. It can either be skins. Right now, I only have skin one. It can be champions. Board skins, summoner icons, and then your materials tab has all your different stuff in it. So let's go ahead and open this five crate, five hex tech chests and keys package. And we can open, uh, so since we have five keys, we can open all five crates. So I'm going to open the first chest. Okay, so Lionheart Brom, I've got the shard for that, and I can either disenchant that shard, say I hate that skin or whatever, I can disenchant that shard for essence. So we'll go ahead and just add that to the loot first. So that, that was one thing, um, and it looks like if I disenchant it, it gives me 250 orange essence, and if I actually want it, I have to spend 450 essence to, to actually craft the actual skin. So we'll go in and see what we get out of all these chests first um, before deciding on what we want to disenchant or enchant or whatever you want to call it. Tomb Angel Ward. The ward skin. I've already crafted one ward skin. It was the Mecha Ward skin. I did that earlier today. Just playing around with this thing a little bit. Oh, me. Fanatic Gragas. Cool. Skin shard. I think the skin shards are probably the best ones you can get because I mean, usually a common person, if they are going to spend money on this game, they spend it for skins. Queen Ash, okay, already have a couple Ash skins. Last chest here it is Yellow Jacket Shen. Cool, I've been playing a lot of Shen lately, more jungle than anything else. And then up here you can see everything you've got. So I've got five skin shards, a ward skin, and I do have a key fragment I earned from an earlier game. And you can get three key fragments to unlock uh, a full key, to craft a full key. So let's see. Fanatic Grogus one, 250, 450, are they all like that? Oh no. I guess the better skins give you more. But, but here's here's what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna craft the yellow jacket Shen skin because it's, it looks like a cool skin, and then I'll disenchant the Queen Ash skin so you guys can see what what we're talking about here. So if I hit upgrade to permanent skin or skin permanent, um, basically I'll just use my 220 orange essence, and it's gonna give me the skin. Now I have that unlocked, and if I go into Champions here, go to Shen, I'll have Yellow Jacket Shen owned. So that's cool. Um, now we're going to see what it's like to disenchant a skin. And uh, Which one do I want to disenchant? I, I, I don't ever play Mundo, so let's just disenchant this one. Oh, and it says up here, has been permanently added to your image. Cool. So let's... That. So then it added more essence down here for me. Um, let me see. 
And I guess, I mean, I'm not particularly found, fond of any of these, so let's re-roll into a ri So if I re-roll, these three will re-roll into a random permanent skin that I get. So I'm just going to try that. I just have to choose the other three ones I don't really want. I'm just doing this for, for video purposes. Um, so we'll re-roll it. And it's just going to give me a permanent skin. Traditional Sejuani. So now I have that skin unlocked too. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much the basis of uh, the hex tech crafting. It's pretty cool. Um, you earn chests by like doing really well in games, like achieving S rank levels and things like that. Uh, S ranks in your games. Um, you also earn just keys randomly when you play games. They drop randomly. Um, so yeah, it's a really cool system. Um, I like it. I'd like to hear what you guys think about it. So let me know in the comments. Um, if you like the video, if, if you learned something from it or whatever, hit the like button. Let me know. Let me know what you learned. Um, but I think the system's cool. And uh, I don't know. We'll see where it goes. Maybe they can make something cool out of it. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. If you did enjoy, please like, subscribe, comment. It's cool to hear from friends, people I don't know even. So, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.